What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Greg. Go crazy, go crazy. Yes, we're back here with another video, man. Now, before you do anything, go on and hit that like button for your boy. Go on and hit that subscribe button for your boy. And also, don't forget to turn on post notifications so you can be notified every time I post a new video. Now, as you can see by the title and the thumbnail, I'm making a Prime Dwight Howard build. And this build will be able to do some amazing things like this. Can they get a good look at the oh! Oh! Nelson escaping Holiday. The long Now that prime Dwight right there was going crazy on the magic. Now that's some of the things that this build is going to be able to do in 2K22 if you make it this way. Now this is an inside type center. Y'all know Dwight was an inside type center for the magic. If y'all don't know Superman is in the building. If y'all don't know about that man, that era man, I don't know what to tell you. But you can see you're going to want to make this build 6'10", 265. You want to gonna max out his wingspan 27 for 8. Now the player's body type, you can make the body type whatever body type you want it to be. The body type is preference, but me, let's see what I think. I think I kept him at solid or I changed it. No, I changed it to build. I like all my players just to be for their body type just to be built. Now, as you can see by the Dwight Howard build, I maxed out his driving dunk and I also maxed out his standing dunk too. Because y'all know Prime Dwight was catching bodies in Orlando, as you could previously see from the clips. And if you look at highlights from him, now I know everybody wants to build. Now, y'all know Dwight couldn't shoot. Dwight now can shoot a little bit, but he's not as good as he was back in his prime in Orlando. So I only gave this build a 70 free throw. You know, I gave this build a little bit of playmaking so he can at least be able to pass the ball up court. Even though Dwight wasn't really a passer, but you know, every build needs to be able to pass. We're going to make an inside center build. Now, as you can see by the physicals, I maxed out mostly everything. You know, you always got to max out the speed and acceleration. And you also got to put his strength up just a little bit and his vertical just up a little bit. Now, as you can see by the defense, I gave his block. Offensive and defensive all 99. I maxed that out. You see he got 35. Now you see I have a little bit of bash points left. I'm gonna put the rest of it on his finishing so he can get more finishing badges in the paint. And I just maxed out his driving layup and I also maxed out his post control. So he can go on the post with this build too. Now as you can see, this build does get crazy slashing badges. He ends up with 31 slashing badges. Slashing slash finishing badges. You know the white didn't really get no shooting. Like I said, he get a little bit of playmaking. Crazy defense. 35 defensive badges for a center seven foot. I mean, no, this build is 16. My bad. 16. Hey man, you're going crazy with it. You can go out seven footers with this build if you really want to. If you use this build properly, I mean, you got all the badges you need. You ain't really got that many shooting possibilities, or you got kind of playmaking possibilities. But the defense, you got all those Hall of Fame badges, which is just wonderful. Like, look at that. That's beautiful. Come on, now. All those defensive badges you can choose from, all Hall of Fame. Now, for the takeovers, y'all know Dwight. He was getting boards. He was the rebounding, like, rebounding of the year some of those years back in his prime. So, I went with glass cleaning downs as his takeover. And I also went with stuff blocks because Dwight used to get crazy amount of blocks. I think he was an NBA Blocks leader too back in his prime too. But yeah, Dwight used to be a glass cleaning block maniac. Slashing maniac. Now as you can see, this build title comes out labeled as a paint beast. It don't even compare it to Dwight. I always say Rudy Gobert for finishing. Like, come on, come on, man. Hey man, but 2K and their comparisons, it is what it is. This is my version of Prime Dwight. Howard. Now, as you can see by the finishing badges, you know, he has a lot of different possibilities. But me, personally, I would give him gold posterizer, gold lob city finisher. Now, right here, it might get the little tree. See, I also put on gold putback boss, Hall of Fame fast twist. But I'm going to lower his back down punisher down just a little bit. And I'm going to lower that mouse in the house just a little bit just to put it on something else like Rise Up. Rise Up is a good badge to put on Hall of Fame. So that also helps him dunk quicker and stronger at the rim. Now, unstrippable, that's a good badge too, because even if your center might be on a fast break sometimes, 
they guards won't rip him as much as they do other players now you see i did tone down his back down puncher like i said i was and i put on grace under pressure on goal so he can also be able to you know finish with grace under the rim i mean sometimes two can make you do stupid stuff but on to his playmaking back you see i gave him hall of fame break starter i gave him gold bullet passer bronze bella and i gave him bronze diamond just for it don't even matter just for the extra badge i mean i couldn't really put it on nothing else but yeah now on to the defensive badges now for the defensive badges for this build i gave him hall of fame brick wall intimidator Hall of Fame Rebound Chaser, Pogo Stick, Hall of Fame Rim Protector, Hall of Fame Box, and also Hall of Fame Worm. Now, for this center build right here, you're going to go ballistics. You're going to go crazy, stupid, all the way retarded in the paint with this Dwight Howard build, man. If you don't believe me, make this build, test it out, come back to my video, and let me know how this build turned out for you. But yeah, man. That's really it for the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. This has been your boy Greg. Go crazy. Go crazy. Yes, man. We still out here grinding. Make sure to sub to the YouTube channel and share it with other 2K heads, man. And I'm out. Peace.